Hey, what's going on everybody? Today we are looking at another product from DD Hi-Fi. This one is the BC150B, and this is a replacement uh, cable, a headphone upgrade cable for full-size headphones. And it comes in a variety of options. We'll go over that in just a second. As you can see here, you have the um, one 145 centimeter, 195 centimeter, and 295 centimeter. You also have a choice of a 3.5 millimeter dual termination. The 3.5 longer termination, this is an extended 3.5. Sennheiser 2 pin, Sennheiser HD 800S, and Focal Lomo Utopia connection. And those are the variety of connections. And of course, the uh, this one is terminated in a 4.4 millimeter balanced, so it's a balanced headphone. And I'll just put this right here if I can without hitting my keyboard. And we'll take a look at the cable. Now the cable is very robust. Uh, a little stiffness to it, but it is overall, it is soft. It's pliable, it's never gonna tangle. There's no way that you can tangle this. It's a nice, thick, cable really pretty construction robust connectors look at that splitter excellent okay, that's what i didn't want to do because now i just moved my notes and here's the uh connections into the headphone they also look wise this looks fantastic now What I first look for on a cable, obviously, is looks. You want a cable that is going to enhance the look of what you want. And this one is truly a beautiful cable, really. Next, you want it to be made well, which this is extremely made well. I mean, this this is probably going to last the, long before the headphones are gone. And I use this on uh, the different hi-fi mens that I have. Um, you know, the newer ones, they have the 3.5 millimeter. Uh, the OKC is C Ash, which is a fantastic headphone sound wise. Build wise, you know, not the best, but, but sound wise, an amazing headphone. And this only enhances that. Um, I'm not going to get too much into the sound quality because a lot of people don't think that the cables even make a difference in sound quality. I've noticed that you can, uh, for, for the better or for the worse sometimes, I've had quite a few cables that have like, um, for IAMs, um, there was one in particular, I can't remember which one it was, I might have done a review on it, uh, it literally, the detail and, and soundstage were widened up, and bass was just non-existent, I, it really was a disappointment. Honestly, if, if the if base had just remained, even if it became neutral, uh, that would have been, you know, more than enough because it did a good job with the detail and stuff. But anyway, this one uh, enhances detail, uh, didn't take away from any bass, uh, any sound stage. It was just really, really good, uh, good performing cable. Um, Obviously made extremely well, very, very comfortable, a uh, little stiff, but in time that may not be so. And it, believe me, it is far from the stiffest cable. I have a lot of cables, especially stock ones, that are so stiff, and there's microphonics and everything. No, th there isn't any with this. Uh, just a really well-made cable, uh, as with a lot of things from DD Hi-Fi. They, they take into account, you know, looks. I mean, take a look at this robust splitter. Really pretty. I, I I think I like cables like this. You would see stock on maybe like a thousand dollar headphone or something like that. Uh, and this one comes in, and it, it really isn't that expensive. It's just really well made, well made replacement cable, upgrade cable. Definitely, all these when you buy a new cable, it's called an upgrade cable. And sometimes it isn't an upgrade. Sometimes it's just you know, better looking or something like that. This one truly is an upgrade cable. Uh, it is made extremely well, and I think you could probably use this for many years to come on a bunch of different headphones. I know I plan to. Uh, but anyway, in a nutshell, uh, here is some of the specs. There are a lot of specs in, in a cable. 
You normally don't expect a lot of things to read off when you're doing a review for a cable, but the cable structure is 4N silver, uh, Furakua sil silver copper alloy, 5N OCC made in China, and silver plated OFC shielding. So, and uh, like I said, the, the lengths you can get it in is 145, 195, and 295 centimeters. The weight on this one is 60 grams. And it comes with a 4.4 balanced, fully balanced cable. Really nice. Uh, overall, I would give this very high marks. I like the look. I find it comfortable. And I love the way it's made. It is built extremely well. And for that, I can't find it any faults. Um, definitely good cable. Uh, DD Hi-Fi BC150B. Uh, definitely, if you have, whatever it is, any one of these in your thing for needs. Uh, yeah, I know 3.5 mil. I, I wish this had come in 2.5 millimeter, honestly, because there are quite a few 2.5 millimeter headphones that I absolutely love, uh, including the old Zen, uh, uh, the old um, Hi-Fi Men's that I would have absolutely loved to have a cable like this on because the cables that they come with are meh at best. Uh, so, yeah, I love this cable. I hope the next iteration comes with a 2.5 so I can use it. Uh, even the Robin, the Sigma Robin, I was kind of a little... That was the only thing I could think of with that headphone that I didn't like was it was 2.5 millimeter, and I, all my good cables are 3.5 millimeter. Um, but enough said about that. Good cable great build quality uh definitely worth a look if you're in the market for something like this thank you so much for watching be safe and i'll see you in the next video